I principally work with penguins in the Antarctic. Uh, I also do some work on seals as well, so it's quite varied and uh, I really enjoy it. I go to the Antarctic most years, usually for six months of it every year, so quite a long time. My typical working day in the Antarctic usually starts at around six o'clock in the morning. If it's my turn to cook, then the first thing I have to do is go to the kitchen and bake bread for everybody else on the base. Once I've done that, I also need to check the various equipment that we have down there to make sure it's all working properly. Once I've done that, I'll have my breakfast, get all my Antarctic warm clothing on, and then I'll try to leave the base for maybe 8, 8.30 in the morning to spend my day out working with the penguins. That involves crossing a glacier most days, so it's quite a hike there, and the weather can be sometimes quite extreme doing that. I will spend the day with the birds, and then at the end of the day, I'll return home probably about six o'clock in the evening and help prepare the evening meal with the other base members. I really like going to the Antarctic. I love the fact that I'm able to work in an extreme wilderness environment. It's a real privilege to go there and it's an incredible experience, particularly being able to work with such fantastic wildlife uh, and also to be able to be part of you know, an incredible experience doing world-class science. I think the hardest part for me personally is uh, being away from friends and family. Uh, it's a, obviously a long way and we do have communications to stay in touch. We can communicate on the internet, we have phones now as well, but nevertheless it's a long way and I also miss fresh fruit. In my spare time, I like to read, socialise with the other base members, often we'll play games, darts is popular, so he's playing cards, risk, the board game, um, speak to people at home, either uh, through a phone call or on the internet, uh, watch movies. Those are pretty much all the things that we can do down there. I'm also uh, quite uh, keen on photography, so if I can and I've got free time, I'll go outside and, and take photographs as well. I miss not being able to have fresh fruit, particularly bananas. We do get fruit, but it doesn't last very long, partly because everybody eats it quickly and partly because we can't get resupplied easily. The ships bringing food only come every few months, so in the interim period, we have to make do without fresh vegetables. I particularly miss bananas. <laughs> 